Hello, welcome back to Iron Aids. We are going for a road play for this time. I want to see the gun. Oh, you can turn off the filter. This time we're gonna see what the gap has to offer. Right, right. There is nothing I can actually buy here. Don't need any of these. Oh, well, we'll play and see what we need. It's not open that I'm actually returning for work from work, wanting to play a game. Let alone replay it. Yeah. It's much easier already. Much, much easier. Hello. Oh god, wait, wait, there is too many of you in here. There is way too many enemies in here. Uh, never mind. Why? Why why are you so many? really strong. The downside of the bombs almost killing you doesn't come into play really. It was just to see what the gun has to offer, and after that we can do the we can do the maids. I wish I wish the wait hold up. Yeah, you're fast. Damn, I wish some. I wish the music was. see something if we shoot the last now you reload regardless okay but the gas pretty busted but then I thought the only way you could reload was through the spell by using mana and that was already pretty overpowered Holy shit! It's really strong. But we'll do cross less. I think that's better. And I think it's pretty clear what. Saints. I brought the weapon. 
balance wise. And they keep the ensign when I take it off? Alright. Okay. I like it. As it should be, right? But it's pretty strong. forever it seems we've been this the second level not that I mind I guess Staff, so I don't have to make a new character, so you can try out the mates without making a new character. But oh well. Alright, let's see what the wizard has to offer. If I remember correctly, he had shooting ability and a an, an AOE ability. Yeah. Oh, that's huge. That has huge range. But it's and you can hit multiple targets for 90 damage each. Wow, okay. Can this penetrate? Not, alright. Fair. I shouldn't be able to penetrate. It looked like it would though. Oof. Can't do it, can't. That is even stronger than holy shit. And you regenerate mana by holding down the right mouse button. Can I also equip the seal? I can. Yeah. I mean, I can't block. I can't block it. That's busted. You can also move when you catch a light. Bella Whip. It's just, this is just better in every way. I, I thought the gun was busted, but this is worse. Your melee attack is possible, but oh, who cares? And they even block magic. Shit, I'm pussy. The dog, there was a dog. I didn't see the dog. Oh, I got my hubris got the better of me. The boss is gonna be easier than last time. Alright, let's see. And this is not fun to blame anymore.
Okay. Alright. Green items? They do exist. White light damage from the oak pan. Plus 5 damage. Okay. Well, I can't even see it though. Alright, alright. So, my thoughts. Right, okay. <laughs> Let's get something straight. When a spell, right, you got two spells. You got Lightning Bolt and you got Thunderbolt. Your missile spell, Lightning Bolt, costs 10 mana and deals 70 damage. Thunder does 90 damage and costs 15 mana. Alright, by itself, Thunder is not worth it by itself, right? Because it costs more, it costs 50% more to do about 30% more damage. So unless you really need burst damage, then there'd be no reason to use Thunder. But you can suit it behind bookshelves. It can help multiple enemies. You do it while moving and it has the same cast time. You can keep it as strong as you can keep it as strong as it is. I'd say increase its damage by ten, make it a hundred, but it costs thirty mana, and you have to stop moving to cast it because that's it's just insane. All right, it's just insane. They deal so much damage. The only reason I died was because I was stupid for a moment. Uh, as for the lightning and sand, I guess it's fun for um, melee characters because there's no reason to use it as a wizard. It, your spells just cover everything. I would like to see more spells along the utility line, like traps, area of effect spells, maybe some stun spells. And yeah, that's it. Now, as for the rogue, the rogue clearly uses the gun. Uh, the bomb doesn't really matter as much as the spells matter because you can equip the bomb as any character and be fine. These spells cost a lot of mana, relatively speaking, for what they offer. And it's only they're only really viable over health if you can constantly regenerate mana. But having the ability to shoot from afar infinitely, even though if you don't have mana to cast a reload, you reload automatically and you have infinite ammo. So it's just a win-win situation to just shoot. If they're too close, you can stab them. And stabbing dealt 45 damage. You're supposed to be weak up close, all right? And at times, I could even hit two, two enemies at once if they were behind each other. So, I would say, have make enemies have weak spots. So you shoot the head, 50% more damage. Shoot the legs, maybe they stumble a bit. Shoot the arms, maybe you cancel their attacks. You shoot their armor, it does 50% less damage. You shoot the Saint Knight in the crevice of his helmet, 50% more damage. You shoot anywhere else, it deals less damage. I think of it, I think that'd be better to balance it. So you can still be very strong, but you have to actually try, right? Um, that's it. I like it. I like it. I like it enough that I wanted to come back and play. I'd play more, but there's not much to it right now, clearly. I can't wait for the updates. Keep, rack them in. Alright, I'll see you in the next one.